Good night, Brian Johnson speaking. Hello, <coughs> just talking to Russell. Russell, um, I'm looking at the CCI strategy by the range trader, and I can see a very similarities and catching small up ranges. And I think the um, center point seems to be the zero, seems to be a, a good center point for scalping in the um, in the markets, taking the little sculpts and following them down using the MW formations could be a, a clue. Also, you can notice uh, that the square 48 seems uh, is a longer term more conservative seems to be hitting the point in most of the currencies uh, so let's go through them in the m1 range it gets pretty close to the the tops the, uh, just a second i should put the uh, correct template on And this this particular one seems to take into account the uh, smaller sculpts using the center point as an example on the range 200, 200 uh, plus 200 negative and zero. So I've tried to cover them all to just show you in this one video that of course is a, a sculpting strategy. It, Obviously, the longer term sculpt based on the 48 looks better for me, but for, uh, for short sculpts, of course, this here comes close to these 200 and, and perhaps the center point in the plus 200 minus 200. It's pretty consistent on everything we look at that the 200 range and the center point could be a, a take profit, etc. and using the one or two pips down. So that's just a, a general comment on this one. Uh, on the H4 range, the bosun lines and the various sections seem to come into play a lot better so maybe you could look at that later on um, the h4 range it seems that the uh, cci plus and minus 200 is more relevant as he says in the m1 range um, the actual highest high and lowest low um, in in the m1 uh, seems to be pretty relevant to the 48 square as well so Generally, we, we look at the, I like to use the 48 square, but for a little sculpting, it's an interesting strategy. Uh, thanks very much from Brian.